Game up. We're back to red shirt happy in his new home with the trophies. Still love the WGL trophy. Already scared. Fresh haircut as always. When he has to play a tournament with camera. Is it just me or is his head getting thinner and thinner? Incredible. All right, Lost Temple, cross position. Fly rocking the Star Wars shirt, let's go. Fasia Wyvern, he won the group Fly did. The weakest group arguably in the round of 16, but still causing some upsets. Goes to show that he is in a sweet spot right now, in good shape. And he is going Blade Master. What? Okay, I did not expect this, but Lost Temple always the odd one out. And as we said, if there's some things that Happy can't perfectly calculate. Then it's usually good for you. Okay, I am very intrigued. Neo, you betrayed me because of the Farseer prediction. Well, you always say in chat, like, this is over, this is gonna happen, yada, 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 yada. Trying to be a prophet, trying to be a Farseer. Isn't it nice when you get befuddled every now and then? So, shop up the high ground. Interesting creep route already. That is, of course, as we all know, level 2, plus a solid Blade Master item. At the fountain, he can heal for basically free. Happy 7 Acolytes already. Doing fast expansion versus Orc, right? Oh, Acolyte was threatening a steal, but no. He got that. He got that last hit. Okay. Windwalk, crit, gloves of haste. Happy also with level 2, get the expo up. Fly in the meantime. Tekken, I think this has become more or less the norm. Instead of countering the fast expansion, you rather rush tier 3 and then tiny against it. And we open the temple. How big is this Blade Master going to be? Fly has defeated Happy before. With the crit gets the last hit. Another Gloves of Haste. Extra experience from the skeleton. Fly fighting! Happy only ghouls. Blade Master, of course, not that great against big groups of ghouls. His single target is amazing. But against mass, he struggles usually. Oh wow, we're going for the fountain this early! Ooh, Happy knows. Happy's here. DK wanted to harass eventually. He got the information, of course, a long time ago by waking up the creeps. Oh, I feel like quite some grunts are going to fall, are they not? Happy in position for the block, doesn't really get him on first try, second try. Okay, kind of walked into that surround right there, buying some time for the other units. And Fly wants to pimp this Blade Master more. Heavy on items, counter expansion on the way to tier 2, Happy scouts it immediately. Oh, that was close, oh, that was so close. Wasted call by Happy. Got a telly staff. 
sprints across as there is a ghoul threatening and more ghouls are coming. I don't think Fly is ready for this. Oh, this is too much damage. At least it keeps the DK from creeping. But the damage up time isn't enough. Well done. Oh, sick timing. We're happy, of course. But at what cost? Blade Master has another wind walk soon. But also gets a grunt. Oh. No deny. Okay. Lots of losses. Two grunts dead compared to two ghouls, but there is potential for more with some buddy blocks. Happy actually lost surprisingly little. Up until I say it, and then the caster curse hits him, and then he loses two more. But he has an expo. It's running the entire time. There's no tech advantage in a second anymore for Fly. Staying at tier two... Trying to expand again. This takes a long time. Very defensive play necessary for Fly, but he's moving into the t uh, into the temple. Four skellies. Oh, 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 not a big fan of this tier two play. Windwalk Raiders here. A little bit of a miss movement. No storm. And he get surround. Okay. But there's no stomp, as I said, opening his way up by killing the Great Hall. And Fly is very short on lumber. He was out of position for a little bit longer. Not sure if this aura is the right call. Happy's expansion is... Happy's expansion is strong. Static defense coming up. Nerup. As well as Spirit Tower against potential Wyvern. Raiders are coming though, first and foremost. And yeah, no stomp. No stomp is rough. How much time can the Blade Master buy? There's a Nerup Tower up already. He got crazy attack speed, so maybe that doesn't matter. Ooh, happy. Shaking a little bit. Fly is getting the time, though. Switching to Wyvern now. And Snare is enabling some kills, reduces the amount of ghouls. Happy can of course go for Alchemist if he feels like that's necessary. Lich out, double ghoul production. Yeah, and how do you stop this? Oh, scary. No creep jack here. Okay. Guys, we might live in a world where the two players who got the t uh, fountain will lose the game. There's an ad. Mana Potion TC. Closing in on level 3. Heal potion also pretty nice. Blade Master's lack in damage. Like... N the damage in number. Average damage. Attack speed is good. And more creeping. Big camps. Fountain first, now red spot. Taking that away. Garg's coming as well as Dreadlord. But Fly... There was just a token wyvern. He... Kind of tricked Happy into thinking that Mass Air is gonna come. When it's not. He's going into Headhunters. Tier 3 around. 
Attack into the base now. Happy has a town portal, can respawn whenever he wants. TC, stop. Lots of ghouls on the line. He has a TP himself, gets level 4, gets level 3. And if he kills the slaughterhouse, that's a huge win, but... Doesn't have the damage up time. Okay, Wyvern is down. Blade revealed. He must realize that there's a shade. Oh, oh. Fly going for the greedy play. And suffers again, again. Level four, Blade Master dead. Ooh, still not willing to TP out against Sleep and Nova. His expo is up. Tier 3 is coming. You gotta TP out at some point. Yeah, that's the catch. Mm hmm. Radar for free. There we go. Where are the defense upgrades for Happy? 1-1. One, one. 50 seconds on the Blade Master still. I guess Happy feels very comfortable now. Ghouls, Gargs, Destro, Statues. Lots of losses. Fly in desperately need of Lumber. Oh, he's so low on number. He still needs like an orb, a new TP. He got that one. But Happy's charging up. Always trying to end the game as fast as possible. And against Orc, you really should. Fly got all red spots. Every single one. But it might just not help him. Critical strike level 2. Alright. No cement. No tower. And a myriad of gold. Uh, gold ghouls. Ancient Django. Not that great. No spikes. Fly has a lot of gold though. Maybe sacking this base is the right call. But he's supply blocked. Oh, that's the big issue. That's the big issue. Going for a heal scroll. When he has to defend at home. Second attack upgrade coming. Fly's army is looking... Is looking rough. But Happy is also giving him a little bit of time. Shadow Hunter out. When you're ahead, get further ahead. And with level 4, 3, 2. Wow, even Vamp Aura. No carrion. And a tiny Great Hall Expo. Aura. I'd go as far and say the skill choice on the Dreadlord will not influence the outcome of this game too much. <laughs> but it's an interesting twist. Hmm. Mirror image, Chris. Oh, 
Okay, okay. Happy is allowing fly a tiny great hole. The shade sees everything at all time, of course. And he knows exactly what to do. TC level 4, Shadowhunter level 2, but still like, lacking that level 3. Happy gladly took the trade. For the dreadlock. Sleep 2! Now I've seen everything. Okay, claw. Claw, glove, circlet, orb. Oh, there's also double heal scroll. <laughs> heal ward, invul potions everywhere. And this is the big fight. I don't think Fly is ready, but hey, prove me wrong. A gigantic supply lead. S sleep on the TC, can't even join the fight. Nuke on the blade, little bit of healing, but it's only level one. Mirror image again, disrupting things a little bit. Sleep again. This TC is such a non-factor. Lovely. Mirror image, but too little, too late. The carry is gone. And oh boy, is that a destruction! Destruction! I've rarely seen a TC less meaningful. Double sleep, triple sleep, whatever. And that is game. Yeah, pretty much what we expected, I would say. Pretty much what could have been expected. And Big Demi. What a legend. What a killer, dressed in red. Dude, I'm... I'm getting... Please don't... Think. Don't, don't look that mean at me. Whew. Yeah, that was pretty good. Expo timings. Expo timings just well done. Instant expo, and if you don't punish that... No towers, no spikes. Aurora Gaming is in chat, yeah, let's go! Thank you very much for picking our finest. I hope we see him in that sweet jersey on camera soon. Very, 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 very cool that you uh, pick up Warcraft players. Happy deserves it for sure. Hardest working person in the entire scene. There we go. Yeah, Fly! Merely a streamer, he says, plays his own tournaments. There were some good foundations here. I think a heavily creep Blade Master can be a threat. But that that loss in the main man. He just got level four and three. Started to somehow claw back. Thanks, we love Warcraft and happy of course the legend of RTS. That's true. Gotta work on his interviews, though. <laughs> no, they, they, got, they got better at the last Rara, for sure. He's in on the memes. All right, all right, all right, all right. Yep, he's all right. Ooh, note to self, do that all, all right merchandise. We gotta have all right merchandise. They should add happy to the Dota team. Dude, can you imagine this guy solo mid? I don't want to be up against Happy Solo Mid. A carry for sure. So Fly, your first loser's pick, Twisted Meadow, still a big map. Still time for some shenanigans, but of course a lot smaller than Lost Temple. Because all maps are smaller than Lost Temple. I still want to know what all these trophies are. Bottom right WGL. Upper right? I'm not sure what upper right is. Ooh. 
Where's the Lin merch? Well, if Lin comes to Rara Land and owns everybody, he might get merch as well. While everyone is signing StarCraft players for Riyadh, we signed Happy for the Soul. <laughs> ah, that's sweet. That is very sweet. If only he'd play a little more fun strats. But his only aim in life, destroy people as fast as possible. And be as dominant as possible. Blade Master again. Wow. DK Ghouls, always the opener. Can you pimp that blade? Are we... Are we sure that switching to mirror image is the right call? I mean, that's a late game question. Reaching that late game is the first issue against Happy, always. But yeah, the problem is and will remain ghouls. And Chain Lightning is certainly a better source of damage against ghouls than a Blade Master is. We'll see! What Fly is coming up with now, got slippers, that's fine. Happy also starting with creeping for instant level 2, as he oftentimes does. Movement speed, the most important thing. But Fly doesn't seem to be deterred. Is he now the only one not going for Wyvern anymore? Healing not cancelled. Oh, it's already already a big ghoul group. Resource management on fleek. Oh, fly ready for the steals. That's an easy one almost. Okay. Okay. With a little bit of crit luck, this might be two kills here. Happy school micro, not perfect enough. Uh oh, blade. Oh, oh. Nah, grunt block. Coil cancels the healing, but he has more selves. That was really well done. Couldn't get the big one, but it's preventing level three for a little longer. Ghoul loss as well, on basically no cost. Oh, the block! The skeleton position so sick! There's another coil. Might even be two. Unwilling to invest it, though, for now. And Berserkers are, of course, great against ghouls. Everything that has good damage is good against ghouls. Grunts, for example, not that much. Dondo? Uh I'm tempted to take your VIP away. <laughs> yeah, I'm very surprised that we see Fly with Blade Masters. Very, very, very much. Arch, thank you for the 28 month. Let a man gloat. Only if you send me a sound file of a goat. All right, a more stable early game thus far. Obviously a whole different game, because Happy on this map did not expand. It's about tier 3 timings, and that timing looks fine. Is Fly establishing any sort of base defense?
Lin was playing Burrows and Towers for quite a while. But we don't even have the Wormel yet to go for Cement. <gasps> Rune Bracers? Nice! Nice! Level 3? Nice! Alright, Fly. I guess the first 7 minutes of this game better than most expected. Happy scanning for Blade Master. Big mana as always. And this blade a little bit too late. Level 3 can't be prevented anymore. But with the Rune Bracers, you can be quite brave. But getting lasted steals against Happy's Nova is, is something. Lost a ghoul? Oh yeah, he did. Washed. Nicely playing around this blade, though. This could have been way worse. Way worse. Shut down the picks of a claw. That's kind of nice. But Happy is done with tier 3. Is it going to be a Dreadlord once again? Or are we switching it up? I'm fairly sure we're switching it up. Warp Online. Dark Ranger. Yeah, he keeps the slippers. So a Dark Ranger is very likely. Fly's game plan seems to be creep as much as possible. <laughs> Calm before the storm. Happy selling the big mana. Interesting choice for sure. Vamp aura, not too bad. But Fly, you took that risk at pretty much the worst timing. Is that... Oh, boy. Like, there's no TP. Everything's hurt. Spikes now. Happy is giving him some time. Tier 3 is done. No orb. Hoping for a spell shield. Death of Silence. No TP, man. This is gonna be... Katka's gem, okay. Tanky, tanky items. We do have a tower. We do have a TC. But no Beast Readers yet. Happy sees the opener pretty much immediately. This time no orb, but rather... Uh, no orb. No aura, but rather stomp. Beast Readers will be up, but... No production at all. Fly, he's still creeping. He got the gold. But no Kodo, no Ensnare. Working on spikes, maybe a little late. No surface area for repair up until now. TC's in trouble, but that's a sacrificial cow that you have to accept. TP, fly, where are you? Where are you? What are you doing? Here we go. Only a staff. Oh. Okay, we live. I don't quite understand Fly's movement. Wow, second big healing. Where'd he get that? Ah, the Merc. Okay, yeah, yeah. I'm really... <laughs> I'm really curious what Fly's game plan is. His Blade Master is sick now. I'm lost. Yeah, I'm totally lost. Sappers? Ooh. Close, close, close. Kaboom! 
Okay, follow-up damage done now. Narrow is down, floodgates open, happy in the base though. This is a game of chicken. Happy doesn't have a TP. How much damage is Fly going to do? He only has grunts, no mass raiders, no mass wyvern or anything. This is still questionable. He wants to take all the acolytes. Happy can't rebuild them at the moment. The tower is holding, the burrows are holding. Fly is obviously losing some stuff too. He's also supply blocked. He's just going for the haunted? Well, there's... Is there an acolyte left? There's no acolyte left! Tower down. Town portal now. No, it's not. It's, oh! With rune braces and katkas, there's very little damage from Coil Nova. When is the rest of the army following? Now! Okay. Okay. What a weird game. Happy needs to sacrifice a ghoul to build one acolyte back, then re-haunt. I didn't understand this. I questioned this. Turns out, Fly maneuvered himself into a pretty good position. If the game goes longer, because Happy is not re-haunting. This is all Happy has. But Happy still has Coil Nova and his incredible control. We have an invul on the cow. That's important against the silence. The statues are empty. Oh, cow. TC, here we go. Nice silence on the Shadow Hunter. Needs some healing ASAP. Late Master's laying in the damage. I'm still not 100% sure that this is a fly win, but it should. It really should be. TC survives. Shadow Hunter out of mana. And Happy can get Acolytes back now if he wants. And he does. Ooh, still. Fly, I'm still worried, man. I'm still worried. He gets the shop, though. That is so important. And Happy, what do you do now? Five ghouls down. Five remaining. Red spot for the bounty. No narrow. Only the Black Citadel attack speed is still good though due to all that agility. Oh, Happy. Seemingly annoyed. And that's another cancel. He doesn't have the lumber at the moment for another haunted. What an atypical orc play by Fly. Super creep heavy. Staff is ready again, in case you need the blade. Tower isn't up yet, but in a second it is. Or not. If I still scouting, is there an expansion? Is there anything I should worry about? But no, there's not. And I think taking a map is already more than most would have expected here. Happy has the lumber back. But that is another cancel. Dude, the game sense by Fly to not staff back, to stay present and continue to slaughter this haunted. How many people would have gotten baited into a base defense? And now you just leave. The rune braces are so good. And again, happy low on mana, stepping back, can heal up. Fly! When did he use his army the last? I think he's using his army 
to, to heal up the Blade Master again. What an annoying playstyle for Fly in the best way possible. Now red spot. Uh, I would have... would love to see a tiny, but I don't think they can still go for it. Kodo tanking, not perfect. Dark Ranger has some sick inventory. <laughs> Sorry. Fellhound for mana burn can be sweet. And that's the next win condition. Island Expo, when Happy has no gold and not a single air unit. He's probably quite joyous that the Blade Master seems to be gone. Ooh, I don't want to be close to Happy right now after this game. I'm sure he sells the item to not give the position away. Get an invul for it. Sold, invul, there we go. And now Happy doesn't know. He can't expect it, but he doesn't know. 1200 gold for Fly. Happy is mining again. The gold difference is 3500. That's what? 16 fiends? Oh no! No, 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 no! Why? Why, 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 why? Oh! You don't have to lose your Blade Master all the time! He has 1200 gold. He's not going for the tavern revive. He has to wait 75 seconds more. Oh no. No, 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 He lost his altar. Another sapper apparently. Didn't see that, didn't connect well. A grunt, a kodo, and two peons. Don't tell me Happy is winning this. Oh no. Dude, scouts everywhere. Happy seemed to be a bit confused. What's going on? This is the throw of the year. Blade is back, at least. Fly still with all the chances in the world, by the way. Bad crumbs, thank you very much for the sub. Sheena, that's fuck yeah, thank you for the sub. He am so tanky. Much wow. <laughs> 
He handed over the card gas, okay? He handed it over. No, don't, don't, yeah. Fly! <sighs> Happy's expanding. out of lumber. Never give up, never surrender. Find the comeback when it's not possible. It, it was impossible. Oh, sick dodge against the coil. I like that fly. Those are the little moments that can bring you back. Okay, here we go again. Onto the haunted. Blade Master's crazy trying to get level 5 to get into fighting shape. Mm. There's a town portal. Okay, 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 okay. Zeppelin should be empty. Here. Okay, that's, let, let's crit level 3. Crit level 3 is crazy. Does Fly even have an idea about this expo upper right? No, right? You got... Oh. <laughs> I'm so worried about the Zeppelin. Just get out. Just get out. Yeah, thank you. Blade Master's laying in the damage against Acolytes again. And he did do some damage. Not as much as before, but there's damage. He has no idea about this expo now. He has no idea. <laughs> this turned into a just shouting stream. <laughs> yeah, kinda. This is not a Warcraft cast, this is a Warcraft 3 fan watching a Warcraft 3 cast. <laughs> ah. <sighs> Torin, Torin, Torin. Okay. Let's go, we gotta fight, no? Destroyer under pressure pretty much immediately. Silence on the cow can break through it. That's level three soon. Torrent aren't connecting. They're running around like headless chicken and didn't attack once. Only now, three destroyers up. Fly, where's your focus fire? Two destroyers, very, very hurt. One will catch a coil. Oh no, both die. 10 food gone. This blade master is cleaning house. I never doubted Fly for a second. Coil misses, that storm dodged with an invul. Happy. Oh, it's about the first heroes. There we go. Shadow Hunter in trouble. Lich dead. Shadow Hunter 5 fly owning this fight. Everyone knew. We were never worried. The comeback was always just a just a play from us to make this sound more exciting than it actually was. Dude, fly, it's like, he starts the game on steroids, makes the greatest decisions, then takes a 10 minute nap, and gets some amphetamines in the arm, and owns this fight.
What the hell? What the hell? He still doesn't know about that second base, by the way. Main base by fly is empty. Happy's main base is still mining for another five minutes. Fetterman's in the army. Yeah, that's how wild he is. And by the way, can we appreciate... Yeah, yeah, chat says it as well right now. That Twisted Meadows is the greatest map of all time. If they remove Twisted from the pool, I'm cutting the War 3 Champions funding. This is not allowed ever. It's the greatest map. Fly has a second second base, also called the third base. The inventory for Fly is crazy. He has a million potions. Wonder if he uses them all. Oh, Happy looks worried. Against five, five, three hero levels, he should be. My snooze button for ads is exhausted, by the way. This game is very, very, very long. He finds it! He finds it! Nice! Okay, that's a point of attack. Thank you, Buttcrumbs, for another gifted sub to Hinter Dragon. All right, two base versus one base advantage soon. And Happy could never do anything against this Island Expo. Island Expo saving games. Five, four, four heroes. With five, four, four hero levels, everything is always possible. I should take Happy's Islands. Now you're getting a little, little too far ahead. Don't, don't, never, never, never do this to Happy. You know, guys, we've been here before. There's, there's definitely potential for a crazy Happy fight, and then he just wins. Let's go! Walkers, Kodos, Headhunters, four destroyers! Oh, let's see how this goes! Happy lost a lot already. Five ghouls dead immediately. Destroyers are the issue though. That was the one heal scroll. Happy has one more. TC has a lot of stomps, but what can he actually target on the ground? I guess skeletons. Headhunters falling like flies. That's three down. Dark Ranger in trouble. Gets healing. Stomp on a lot. Blade Master level six. 264 crit. Dark Ranger saved perfectly. Shadow Hunter. No, no, no. Should be saved. Dark Ranger dead. Shadow Hunter. Invul potion. Stomp. Lich. Blade slowed though. No more mana on the DK. No mana potion. GG. Oh, fly. You are a hell of an entertainer, my dude. What a god. The god of losing blades, of course, but... What a god. Twisted Meadows goes to fly. One, one.
You doubted Fly would be able to take a map. I told you that there is days in a year where Fly is incredibly competitive. And that was one of these days. Aurora Gaming TV with the five gifted subs. Damn. Your player is losing and you're gifting subs? I like that. What happens if your player wins? Welcome to the Warcraft scene, guys. It's really, really, really cool to have you here. This is an experience that... Because so few... Um, Western pro players are signed up with the team. This is really nice. Welcome, guys. Whoo! Okay, the Blade Master's working. That was Fly's first loser's pick, though. And an extraordinary... Extraordinary way of playing it. Of course, as always, very economy heavy. As the Wyvern player is also very economy heavy. People were able to surprise Happy with the Wyvern. I think those days are over. And Fly is finding a new approach. I like it. With the blade, the uncalculatable blade, and a lot of creeping. You know, Happy though... He'll figure things out. He'll make adjustments on the fly. Sometimes it takes a map or what one and a half maps, but he'll find solutions to this. Hammerfall, especially bad for Blade Master Pimpin. There's quite some consumables on this map, which can help. But when it comes to claws, slippers, etc., etc., there's not too many. It's not too many. And you know what Happy does to people that take maps against him, right? Like usually, usually he destroys them quickly thereafter. But when it counts, Fly was there. When it counts, Fly was there. And we got like, what is it? 2,400 people watching on a Monday? Feels good. Feels real good. I'm worried for Fly? Hell yeah! Me too. Emperor's Revenge! Yeah, what a... In comparison to last year, right? What a flawed season already for Happy. Losing to Sock, losing a map to Focus, now losing a map to Fly. This probably worse than three out of four other seasons last year. Which is crazy. <laughs> which is crazy. But yeah, you know, just happy things. So... Fly. No rags. Is it a Farsia here on Hammerfall? Yeah. Is A, I like it just to switch it up, to keep Happy on his toes, to display to him. I play both styles. And here on Hammerfall, as I said, not the greatest potential for a Blade Master. So one was able to defeat Happy here with that. But I'm, I'm really curious what Fly has ready for this map to surprise Happy. Because you gotta. Could just be that the entire scene is getting better. I wouldn't say the entire scene, but in general, the general direction of your statement is very true. Don Dolores suddenly not in chat anymore, right? Now that there's a Farsia Wyvern play, all of a sudden the Dondo guy is gone. This Farsia play is of... Ooh. That's very aggressive. 
creeping at the shop. Remo has been criticizing Happy's creep routes for a long time. Especially here on Hammerfall. But you can see that in this very case, he did everything correctly. Fly can't find him. <gasps> Double Rex! It's not Wyvern! It's the Lin style! Two Rex Headhunters. Fly can't get a connection at all. Or was this all timed? No, I don't think so. Finds Happy on the way back. And now is where you want to be annoying with the Farsia. This is where you want to be. When the poison's on the ghouls, you want to strike. Good save. This coil not missed. DK clicks on the Farsia. Last hit. He got something, but the main creep goes to happy. Yeah, I think it's just a skeleton or something on Fly's account. Shadow Hunter, Double Head Hunters. Lots of Hunters. Fly, after a little bit of an issue in the very beginning, is disrupting creeping. Got a ghoul. Bit of chip damage here and there. But that's about it. Tier 3 on the way. Problematic. Farsia levels. He got a steal somewhere. Oh, that, that was the ghoul probably. Happy got a fast level 3. I mean, not a perfect level 3, but it's unrealistic to get a perfect creep route against the Farsia. Then it's the Farsia's player to blame. Couple of ghouls lost. Shadow Hunter out. Headhunter help with creeping. Tier 3 on the way. Tier 3 a lot faster. You can hex the DK. Dark Ranger up though. This is not a position where Fly wants to fight. Skeleton Snowball is starting. DK up front. Not able to block everything here though. Heal away first. There is no hex. Oh my god. Oh, I called Emperor's Revenge and yep. This first fight was pretty gnarly. Ooh, three headhunters down. And I'm pretty sure, yep, that won't be the last one. Good thing he has double racks. He can replenish them quickly, but it's four headhunters. Ay, 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 ay. The Dark Ranger timing, guys. Hitting hard. So many skeletons. The idea was kind of to counter the Dark Ranger with Heal Wave, right? But that didn't work at all. Last hit against the creeps, make it... What is it now? Five, six? This is, this is a total disaster. Well, Fly got tier three! He, that, that's what he got. Like, that's the only thing he got. Happy firing on all cylinders here.
classic DK Dark Ranger. And yeah, it's so hard to find a creep spot where this creep jack isn't possible. But if you go for the lab, that's an invite. You can, of course, creep a little further outside. One of the expos comes to mind, but this will also be figured out. Finally got it. Big mana. Okay. Scroll of the Beast. Very good for ghouls. Yeah, be very confident now. And he can be. He should be. Try Hero Online soon. Ghoul Frenzy Online soon. And there's only one direction. Fly's throat. Coil Mrs. This is not the first time today. Not the first time happy Mrs. Coils today. Dark Render gets the revenge steal though. Noise. Ring of Region and the big one. No level 3. No level 3. 9 minutes 30 in. And contesting... Contesting creep spots versus happy is... <laughs> the storm... Yeah, didn't get the last hit, the Nova did, of course. Damage is ramping up for Fly. And he's getting... Oh, yeah, that TC is dead. Is he? Wait, what? Good escape, but no speed scroll. Town portal swap, TC's alive. But that leaves the entire left-hand side too happy for creeping. That was close. Flies alive! That's respectable. But leveling is gonna be a huge issue. Fasia can't get last hits. It's, it's, it's impossible for something. Fasia hurt. TC hurt. Ghouls find the connection to the headhunters. Chain lightning is way too weak. And I guess we're having steak a little delayed today. Ghouls blocked the way, no way out. This is uh, this is how you expect the game to go. If you anger happy the map prior. This mid game was just a total disaster. Supply is still somewhat even, but the levels are not. Like Three and two. Big skeleton boys now. That Shadow Hunter not having level three is such a huge issue. This was the big mana potion consumed as well. We have one more Nova very, very soon. Just can pick the target. Pick the target, Happy. World's your oyster. Boom, in the middle of it all. And a crazy supply lead. Happy smashing every fight in this game. Clearly. Fly with the early game mistake of not finding Happy early on. And DK is one map away from the winner bracket semi-final. Overjoyed as always. Where's, where's the Rara trophies, guys? I can't see the Rara trophies. That's a bit of a shame, but yeah, there he is. 
rocking that sweet Team Aurora jersey. And now one step away. Guys, we're one map away from Happy versus 40 in the winner bracket semifinal. People on Reddit predicted a top four without Happy. That's blasphemy. But to be honest, it's not impossible. Happy always overreacting, SMH. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm the world's biggest fanboy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Guys, I don't even own a happy jersey. Come on. How can I be the biggest fanboy without a Team Aurora happy jersey? What can I... What, can you even consider me a fan? Talk, 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 talk. Oh, we're wasting no time. Flies Winner Bracket Live on the line. If he loses this map, then he finds himself the lower bracket, obviously. And we got cross position. Turtle Rock flies map pick. So, Blade of Fossia. <laughs> Chat is quite fun today, gotta say. No racks again. Is he trying this again? I'm like, I know I sound like a hater a little bit, but this double Rex headhunter strategy from Lin, I don't see it succeed too much. I'm fairly certain it's not a great strategy. Is Fly switching it up again? Is it Wyvern this time? Well, Remo, what is a great strategy against Happy? You are a 12... Third, you are a 13-month subscriber. And you can't differentiate me and Remo. What, what, what am I supposed to say? I'm the beard. Alright, happy with the creep game. We go for the double headhunter style again. So Fly, I really, really, really hope for you that you prove me wrong. That you show me the way of the double rex headhunters. And that you can dodge the Dark Ranger in the mid game. Something can he reach? Lots of damage on the DK. But thanks to Aura, this is neglectable. Happy showing dominance already. Like, you think this is your half of the map? No, 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 no. Cool creeping at the same time, multitasking, phenomenal as always. But also an opportunity here. Trying to prevent Fossia from grabbing this item. Happy really wants this item. Oh, did he want that item? Didn't get it though. <laughs> On four slippers. <laughs> Might have been better to throw some shots at these ghouls to force another coil, but... Okay.
All right, more damage on ghouls. More, no, no, no. More damage on the DK. Don't get surrounded, fly. I just pray. Ooh, Ooh. <laughs> he's playing this on the edge, as you have to. As you absolutely have to. Okay, tier three on the way. Shadow Hunter on the way. Tech advantage established. Levels not nearly as good as they were before. And now the play with ghouls is getting a bit dicey because of all that piercing damage. So, he's so far away from- Oh no, there's something at the tavern, right? There's gotta be. Yep, Dark Ranger out. But as I said, man, damage is there. Damage on the board. And with that, it's a creeping Dark Ranger. Okay. Fly, this is working out so far. And then I always wonder, if you know you can't get a connection with the Dark Ranger, is it still the right call to go for? Bring up the Archmagi, kinda nice. Fly is getting a lot more creeping done than before. It took him 10 minutes to get to level 3, and now it kinda close is. Dangerous though. Don't give happy an opening fly. Interesting situation now. Happy kind of wants to fight the dark, uh, the headhunter with dark ranger, but you don't want to bring the ghouls because of the headhunters. Nobody can be safe ever. Still happy stalling is good. You don't want to give happy consumables. Ooh. And you don't want to give him a hero either. Gotta lick the wounds. Red spot. Always something you want to go for. But Happy doesn't give him a chance. And with ghouls, you can creep this very, very easy. All right, creep jack, lightning. Strike steel, ghouls going down as well. Uh oh, happy a bit overconfident. Maybe trying to force fly into a town portal, but of course, fly never portals. Fly just dies, and then we'll see where it goes from here. No way out anymore. But does he want a way out? Hex, surround, no TP. Dark Ranger is here. This could be a lot of skeletons. Shadow Hunter might be a two for one trade. Oh boy, that's a lot of XP for the DK, but also a lot of XP on the cow. Level 2 immediately, another ghoul dead. That's quite problematic for Happy. Lich is still in shape though. 
You see, oh, I can't get the item. How unfortunate. Ring of Region, of course, fantastic. Creeps are helping out. Dark Ranger is here. Lich is here. DK is back. Oh, and Fly is only one hero. Happy making use of that Tavern Revive. He got a discount there now, right? TC and SH progress essential. Happy despite the DK loss, playing ultra aggressive. Second crypt now for more ghouls. We wave two online. Fly is crazy, but good crazy. Yes, <laughs> fitting. Bidding. Three, three, close to three. Tanky TC with ring, ring of regen and double heal potion against undead nuke. If he gets the mana potion, that's, I mean, it's clear. Are we ready? More HP and int on the TC, I love that. Happy Katka's pipe or what? Nope, plus plus 12, never bad. Upgrades, more and more upgrades. Very economically efficient game by both, never breaking upkeep. Lich is quite a machine. DK has quite some items. Plus eight, never bad. Ooh, calm before the storm, everybody. This fight is gonna be something. Destroyer up in the air. Levels are there. Not for the Lich, though. Fly's gotta be, gotta be quick. Gotta be real quick. Uh, okay, TP out. Nice. Wait, what he got? I'm confused. Oh, that was early, that was gone before. Three, one. Three, one upgrades for fly. The map is almost empty. Now all necessary levels have been hit. Ring the bell. What can you possibly accomplish? 2-2 two, two upgrades for Happy. Main source of damage will be spells though, so upgrades don't do that much. Even in a stalemate like this, he's always getting something done. Raise new skeletons, clear the few camps remaining on the map. Happy's on match points here. If he owns the next fight, we get Happy versus 40. Happy 
一位玩家的部队正遭到攻击。Flies at home, waiting for upgrades. Super greedy. Sees happy coming. Need to produce now, fast. Chat, what do you think? Is this the end of the series or will we get game 5? Three, two, finished. No chance, it's over. Happy wins, game 5, the end. Fly, end. Guys are a bit indecisive. Supplies even. Double heal scroll for happy. Plus the big mana. This time no sell. Trying to find the TC opener. Chain lightning was there. But it's alright. Would love to see more mana on the fast. Yeah, everything is clumped up. That's the big problem with a lot of headhunters. Can you bring the damage into the fight? Happy feels like this is too much. Trying to find another choke. That was scary for Fly. Two groups of ghouls. And here's the stomp. That was good damage mitigation. Far Shadow Hunter! Super far forward alongside the Raiders. Uh-oh. Now what can you do? The Nova is hitting so much. Needs to spam the spells. Farsi into the back line. Headhunters are running. Oh, Happy is losing quite some stuff as well. Though there's a lot of ghouls and headhunters about to fall, of course. The headhunters will be turned into skeletons if well. The chain lightning! Oh my god! There was such sick damage! But there's still ghouls on the ground. Dark Ranger in trouble. TC level 4. Still a neck and neck fight. Happy still has the big mana potion. Losing statues though. Dark Ranger about to fall. Raider falls as well. Destroyers on the ground. But the statue's been taken out. Huge win for Fly. Keeps the 10 supply lead. Who has the better macro? The mines are empty I guess. TC with one of the last storms we had. Destroyer. Fasia Heal potion immediately. Destro out of the fight. Dead. No. Was he dead? I'm not 100% sure, but I think so. Shadow Hunter out of mana. Is that the moment where it turns around? Lich? Oh, sick nuke, sick safe as well. Needs to save this SH somehow. Has another heal scroll. Skeleton still on the ground. Happy only down to the heroes. Gets level 5. Nuke. Mana potion used. Invo potion on the Lich available as well. Might be able to swap it to the Dark Ranger to keep her safe. Oh, Happy is getting more kills, guys. Eating the skeletons for mana. Fasia has nothing left anymore. The longevity in this fight goes to Happy. Hex, last ditch effort. Stomp him, but not the DK. Not in time. SH on the menu. What a fight. Happy always saw the win condition. Despite the statues gone. Oh boy, he fought this a bit better and he had a little bit more and he is in the winner bracket semi-final versus Fortitude. No celebration for us. As always, Team Aurora, we have to teach him to leave the camera up for a little bit longer. But Happy takes the series. Fly, nice effort. Taking that map on Twisted was a highlight. Turtle Rock could have gone either way. Again, as so often when Fly faces Happy, everybody expects this to be a super one-sided affair. It is not. It never is. But Happy was the better player and goes through with a 3 and 1. Just like Fortitude went through. Oops, I'm punching my mic. Sorry about that. Just like Fortitude went through and now it's the two best players in the world right now facing each other in two days in the winner bracket semi-final. Oh yeah, oh yeah, this is gonna be 